Harding, Editor-in-Chief of Power Motor Yacht. I have an exciting one here for you today. The Wellcraft 355. First time this boat's ever being shown in the U.S. Literally just coming off the ship and Power Motor Yacht has the exclusive opportunity to give you a closer look at this boat. So let's not waste any time. Let's go take a closer look. Right off the back, this one has triple 350 horsepower Mercury outboards. That's the highest rating that this boat has. You could also get it with triple 300 horsepower Yamahas. It really opens up nicely aft. You get the side door, the opening window, it creates a nice open feel for this boat. Side doors on both sides of the boat, not all that common. This boat's currently going to have this really cool wrap, kind of this throwback look to it. Hopefully you can tell, but the window's exceptionally large, opening on both sides. More on that in a second. All the way up to this nice sun pad area. Good place to kick your feet up when the music's going. It's something I had to test just, you know, for journalistic integrity, but a really nice spot to hang out. This, this has got this optional light bar on top. When, when that's paired with the underwater lighting, this boat is really going to be a showstopper. You get these windows open electrically here, and a nice roof rack for some toys. Really, the big ethos of this boat is it, it's kind of got this commuter DNA infused everywhere you look. The boat is really designed to get you from point A to point B quickly, safely, and efficiently. Hop down here. This is pretty cool, right? This option is good for fender storage, good for dive tanks. There's two other optional modules. You can choose between a galley, where you also have some seating here. Step in. Again, this is not the boat you're gonna be spending weeks on at a time. It's got a single cooktop couple different seating options here and this table does lower to form a second berth if you so choose this is the star of the show though best place on this boat is gonna be sitting right here at the helm absolutely fun boat to drive we saw about 47 knots and, and quiet as well especially when everything was enclosed you have twin 16 inch Garmin's zip wake it's got the mercury joystick Take a little tour down below. Go to the size. This is a really nice size couple's cabin. Nice size berth, the TV. Even the head I find to be a really nice size for American boaters. The head, nice tall stand up separate shower. Hard to really appreciate on video, but how much this opens the space up, especially with a little fresh breeze in your hair. Nice wide side deck to starboard. Really, this is where you feel how substantial the boat is. Feels very solidly built, solid underfoot. Plenty of walk around space here. And the nice thing too with the plumb bow is a huge area for, for storage and plenty of chain. This is, a, this is a really a huge investment by Wellcraft from Group Beneteau, and this is gonna be the first of multiple boats. This is not. This is just the beginning of the new adventure focused kind of commuter style boat from this brand. This door is really worth giving some attention to. For on most boats, the opening side door would probably end here where the captain is standing. But on this boat, I like that it opens that little extra A. Get a great breeze and in touch with the elements from your driving. You also have the ability to step around the captain when he's at the helm. Microwave here, so there are plenty of creature comforts, but really this boat is made for is made for cruising underway. I came down from Connecticut this morning for this exclusive opportunity, and with the 6 a.m. flight and even the stop for coffee, we would have made it to Bimini by 11:30, just in time for lunch. This boat will be debuted to the world in the upcoming weeks. And when our schedules allow and they align with this crew, 
and hopefully take the boat for a proper adventure. So stay tuned for more on Wellcraft 355 here in the upcoming issue of Power Motor Yacht. See you on the water.